We want to take a closer look at the Georgia counties with votes that still need to be tallied right now. Right, Mitch? Yeah, Adrian, right now the majority of the state has reported. In fact, we're showing Georgia Senate 99% of precincts reporting. And here you see the results. 49.4% for Raphael Warnock and 48.5% for Herschel Walker. Forget about the margin right here because... Either one of these guys has to get more than 50% of the vote. And with 99% reporting, it looks like Warnock is not going to get that other 0.6% plus one vote that he needs. So this is probably going to go to a runoff. Let's see what's still out there, though. Fulton County, specifically Fulton County, that is the county where you find Atlanta. Just look at how the margin of victory was. It's three to one in favor of the incumbent Senator Raphael Warnock. It's much of the same story in some of the Atlanta suburbs. Let's look at DeKalb County, right outside of Atlanta as well. An even larger margin of victory. Uh, there are also some rural votes out there. There are nearly 250,000 votes out for Warnock over Herschel Walker. They're down south in Savannah. That is Chatham County. That's down here on the coast. Again, not the same uh, margin of victory here for Raphael Warnock, but still you're getting the idea that in more of these urban areas, uh, they're going for the incumbent by almost a 60 to 40 margin. Uh, it's not the same, though, in some of these rural counties. So take a look at this one. This is another wow. rural county. This is right next to Chatham County, uh, but it's uh, certainly less populated. You know, take a look at the vote totals here, 18,000 to 6,000. I mean, that is a three to one margin in favor of Herschel Walker. And there are like 100 counties in Georgia. And so having small or large margins of victory in small counties adds up to sort of equal up to what Raphael Warnock has, which is a giant margin of victory in some of these bigger counties. And that is why it looks like we're headed for a runoff, Adrian. Yeah, and we're, we're, of course, looking to tabulate those numbers. I know that Herschel Walker has to make up a lot of ground in that 2% uh, margin uh, between he and Warnock right now in order to claim a victory. And that is going to be really difficult to do. Well, he's also going to have a month to do it, though. Yeah. But this means they have to do the whole thing again. They have to raise money again. They have to run again. Hundreds of millions of dollars. We're also... Thank you for watching. Go to NewsNationNow.com to find NewsNation on your television provider. And don't forget to click the red subscribe button below to get more of NewsNation's fact-driven, unbiased coverage.